comets began far out in space. There was left over from the creation of the solar system after the planets were formed billions of years ago. Now these chunks of space debris are in an elongated orbit around our sun. And every now and then, one of them gets bumped on a lack of billiard ball on a pool table and is knocked into a different orbit. Now, if this comet continues on its path around the sun and keeps its present course, sometime on August 16th, roughly a year from now, there's a chance that we might have impact. So for the past eight months, the United States and Russia have been building the largest spaceship ever constructed. It's being built in orbit around the Earth, and we call it the Messiah. And right now, a team of American astronauts and one Russian are at Cape Canaveral in Florida. In two months, they will leave on the shuttle Atlantis to board the Messiah. This is the crew that will stop the comet. History will be made on July 8th, all things going right. It's the very last space mission of our last space shuttle, Atlantis. So today I registered with the Kennedy Space Center to try and get tickets for the viewing area. And if we're able to accomplish that, Cindy and I will be embarking on a 4,000 kilometer road trip from the Okanagan in British Columbia right straight across the United States to Florida and witness the very last space shuttle takeoff. And I'm excited about it.